Anthony from Hazards.net, and welcome to our new studio. Now, typically I'd be using a teleprompter to tell me what to say, but uh, this is the new computer. So, no teleprompter, so I have taken notes. So, this new computer is a Dell XPS 8930, and thanks to Dell for sending it to us at a great discount. Um, so, to describe what it is, there's a 460 watt power supply, Nitrin Intel i7-9700, 8-core, 4.7 megahertz turbo processor. A NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1660 Ti 6GB 6 uh, 6 uh, GPU, 16 gigs of DDR4 2,666 MHz of RAM, that sounds dangerous, and 1 terabyte of 7200 RPM SATA hard drive space. Now, I bought an external hard drive because I need to move data, so a hard drive, a large one on the system, it's not really necessary because I'll store video data uh, on the external. I also bought two additional sticks of RAM, both 2,666 megahertz to match what Dell has already put into the system. Uh, so um, I feel like if I have 32 uh, gigs of RAM in the system, it'll be a little bit better. I have to say I love the cases on these. are the PNYs, which I got at uh, Best Buy. Uh, this, this is only $75, and um, typically when you buy system RAM, uh, particularly in Dell's case, they're double that. So. Um, I feel like this is a good buy, and again, I just love the cases, I love black and red together. Uh, but, speaking of, you see this shirt? TrekFederation.com, go buy yours. They also have new editions out, so this is actually a couple years old, so if you can see this, buy one of the other new ones. But for now, let's uh, open this thing. Okay, so we've unboxed it, and you can see the front, there's uh, three USB ports, uh, USB-C port, microphone headset port, and an SD drive port. There is no disk drive on this version. I believe you have to get the XPS special version to get the disk drive, but I don't really use disk drives anymore. So, yeah. So then we go to the back, and we have Ethernet, two more USB ports, four USB 3 ports, another USB-C port, HDMI display port, a um, DV ID port, another HDMI port, another display port. Um, this is, of course, the GeForce graphic card. These are on board, so we're not going to use these. We're going to use these to connect. And then, of course, open base and the power and the LED to indicate power. And so, to take apart the side here, there's a screw. You have to unscrew it, which I've already done. And you just pull. And then you push the piece forward a little bit. And then here's the inside. Now, here's the graphics card, motherboard, and back here, which you can't see, below the uh, power supply is where the RAM chips go. So that's where we're going to install some RAM chips, and that is essentially the, the computer. But then what comes with the computer includes a, what they call a six-button mouse, which um, has the top two buttons, the roller, and then some additional buttons down here. So it's USB, of course. Uh, the power cord, which, you know, obviously we need to have. And one of their newer, flatter keyboards, which um, I'm, I like the bigger, older ones, but I'm told these aren't too bad. I guess I'll find out. So... Uh, by the time you see this video, it's going to be edited on this thing. This thing is, I bought it to make higher quality videos, so hopefully it works out. We'll find out together. So if you're interested, again, this was uh, upgraded, so it's 1410 retail uh, prior to my discount. I, I believe you can get stock models with uh, um, 8 gigs of RAM, a uh, 2 gig graphics card, and the like for less than a thousand. So. Remember to check out Dell.com about the computer, and uh, welcome to the new studio. And as you can see, the computer is set up because that's what we're on right now. And you can see behind me the new studio. And I'm going to put up over here just a quick uh, look of what the actual total list is. Of course, I gave you something a little abridged. Things I'm not going to mention, of course, is the keyboard and the mouse because there are keyboards and mouses. Mices. Mice. Keyboard and mice. And, uh, of course, I didn't buy a monitor with this thing. I actually 
found a sale um, thanks to Best Buy. I got a 27 inch monitor half off. Also Dell branded, so kind of a running theme here, which is funny because my second monitor is also a Dell monitor from a previous computer purchase. So I am just swimming in Dell. Uh, and I have to admit, um, I have been buying Dell computers uh, for the last uh, 15 years because I found sales where it made it just, just cost effective to buy the parts. Like, uh, I'm gonna, what I put, I'm gonna put up over here is gonna show you the cost breakdown and the MSRP, which means uh, at the time of the sale, uh, you weren't paying for anything but parts, which is basically what you'd end up maybe doing if you were building it yourself, which uh, I used to run a computer store, used to build computers and used to price them out and then have a markup. Uh, I think it was somewhere near 20%, don't quote me on that. Uh, it has been, no oh, 20 years, but uh, this was a good computer for the price. I upgraded it from the base, as I said before, and um, I, I want to encourage you next time there is like a major sale and you're looking for a computer and you don't want to have to do the footwork, uh, check out Dell's website. And uh, just a reminder again, um, if you want the t-shirt that I'm wearing, uh, go to trickfederation.com. They have uh, t-shirts in their promenade, which is what their store is called. And uh, thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching this video. We would also like to thank our contributors and patrons for supporting this video. If you wish to add to the discussion, post a comment below. Please remember to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos. Thank you for checking out our content. Before you leave, please remember to click like and then subscribe. If you want to receive notifications, do not forget to enable them by clicking on the bell. Then afterwards, check out our social media at Hasledge.net and our website at hasledge.net.